hello everyone welcome back if this is your first time here hello my name is melanie i post every tuesday friday and sunday i talk about fitness lifestyle health manifestation bonds and cheat days and everything else that's nice and fun and good so if you guys want to join definitely hit the subscribe button and today i will be talking about um kind of my updates i will say this is my fourth time filming this um because i'm trying to find the shortest way to do it and the most effective way to do it so i'm going to put this into two parts the first part is going to be more like um my skincare my health um kind of those goals and then i'm going to go into the second part where it's more general goals uh goals for october and financing so that would be part two and this will be part one um so yeah if you guys want to check the rest of this stick around what went right in september so a lot of things went right in september i think overall september was a really good month for me um so the first thing is that i've been working out five days a week besides one week i think i only did four days um but i have been working out five days a week which is you know great um i did my first album or my first like set of music um on my soundcloud i'll leave it down if you guys want to hear it you don't have to um <laughs> and i had an inspiration for the second one that will be up the 30th so i also got my proposal done for my art project um which was a huge relief for me i was really stressed out about it um i finally got it done and yeah i'm feeling great <laughs> um my skincare routine is getting better my skin is actually getting better i don't know if you guys can really tell but um right now basically just have a bunch of marks i do have a couple pimples here and there but um mostly it's not as bad as it was before um and it is getting better so these three products i use for this is my thayer's witch hazel um this is in peach i use well i'm using now the um soap and glory uh vitamin c facial wash i've only used this for a week though so i'll let you guys know like after a month or so if it really works um but i've seen only good results right now and I'm using the Trader Joe's Natural Facial Cleanser Pads with tea tree oil. Which are these, and they're just like pads that you swipe onto your face. And if you guys want to know my skincare routine, definitely let me know in the comments. Um, I can do a separate video of that. Now, the next thing is the Sam. I can't say her last name, so Sam O. I'll leave her channel down below. Um, challenge. She just makes you do something every single day. It could be very small. And um, yeah, it's super great. I've done everything besides like one or two days. And um, it just gets you in the habit of doing something every day. Uh, either for yourself. Mo mostly it's for yourself. But it's also to kind of get going and kind of get you to be productive um i've been super positive lately and um i've been getting into more yoga which was great for me because i was kind of getting tired of weight training um so getting into yoga brought like a new challenge for me and it kind of reinforced like my love for fitness um this month i've really been eating with no regret <laughs> which is, could be a good and bad thing but um kind of have a better relationship with food um i don't really beat myself up for eating certain things or going over my calorie limit um yes and 
I also have been better at taking care of myself, having a lot of self-care, um, and some things that I've been doing for that is just uh, kind of taking a day uh, to just take care of myself. <laughs> And um, these are some of the products I use. I'll just show you guys. It's a Bum Bum King, um, Rose, Argan Lush. It, these things smell amazing, by the way. This is the Soap and Glory uh, Scrub. And this is their, I think this is the Righteous Butter. Yeah, the Righteous Butter. So I just use these for my self care days. I take a long shower, I take my time with everything so usually I'll be like rushing to put on lotion and, and you know getting dressed and stuff and I usually just take my time on my self-care days and I really try to stay away from anything that's work related uh, to give my mind a rest to kind of cool down my mind so not so right things this September um, one thing I think is feeling like I haven't gotten enough done, even though I have done quite a lot. Um, some days I can really beat myself up for it just done throughout the week or even throughout the day. Um, and for October, I'm really trying to kind of focus on more of the positive things, what I did that day. So I'll probably be journaling more on like my successes of the day. That really does help me see that I've gotten more done than what I've thought. Because um, my limiting beliefs, um, one of them is just like, I'm not enough. Um, in terms of a job or like something that I want to do. And um, so for example, like if I apply for a job, sometimes I'm like, oh, but I don't really have those qualifications. But I don't really know how to do this and this and that. So, huge thing for me that I kind of changed my perspective on that is one, a lot of people don't know what they're doing. <laughs> like, they're just learning along the way. And two, a lot of people would rather hire someone who is passionate about what they're doing instead of having the knowledge already. Like, having the knowledge is nice, but you can always teach someone that. You can't really teach someone to have passion. Um, affirmations that I say to myself is like I have all the knowledge I need I have all this, the skills I need for a job I have um, all the like learning capabilities to learn the material that I need yeah uh, splurging a bit too much so this is a thing for me for food Sometimes I buy food outside when I shouldn't have, but I could just cook at home. Um, I really want to cut down on that for September and for October, and um, yeah, kind of get that out the way. Duolingo, which is just a site, it's just an app where you uh, can learn languages. I've been really slacking and not doing <laughs> Duolingo. Um, and I really want to get back to that because I really do want to learn languages. Artwork, um, I've been more focused on proposals than on actual artwork. I want to kind of get back to focusing on the actual artwork. Um, so I want to create more works and exhibit them. And updating kind of social media and stuff. I'm really bad at that kind of stuff. Um, weird thing for me. Um, but I am going to try to update Twitter and uh, Instagram more often. Things that I'm also doing is looking at more inspo videos. I really like Ron Verona, I think is her name. Um, Sam, Leora, Alexandra. Um, also my kind of goal for my fitness is to lose weight but gain muscle i will be weighing myself in the second week of october um i will continue to do kind of small meal preps here and there 
And I did notice that um, I'm more happy now and I'm more positive now and I can kind of shift my focus to more um, positive kind of things than negative and that my taste palette has actually expanded so things that I didn't use to eat before like uh, spinach and chickpeas and stuff like that and now I'm more open to eating that is that the second part will be up um, on Friday my rundown of everything for September and then for the next um kind of thing um, I will be talking more about my goals for October kind of what didn't really what went through in September um, more general kind of stuff and also my finances so see